Definition Cartesian Product The Cartesian product of two sets S and T is a set of all ordered pairs X, Y such that X belongs to S and Y belongs to T. The result is itself a set and is defined intentionally below. Note that S and T are called the factors of the Cartesian product of S with T. In example 1, we consider the Cartesian product of the set comprised of the letters A and B with the set comprised of the numbers 1, 2 and 3. In example 2, we consider the Cartesian product of the set comprised of the numbers 1 and 2 with itself. In example 3, we demonstrate that the Cartesian product is not commutative with singleton sets. Note that the ordered pairs within the sets are different. A general result is that the Cartesian product of any set and the empty set is the empty set in whichever order you do it. Given the set S, we define the Cartesian nth power of S inductively. This is called a Cartesian space. Note that the Cartesian product is not associative as well. This is demonstrated below. On the first line, on the right hand side, we have a set containing a 3 tuple. And on the next two lines, we have on the right hand side, sets containing ordered pairs. So the Cartesian third power of S is what's shown on the second line and neither of the expressions on the fourth line. Example 4. The Cartesian space R to the N is called the Euclidean N space, though some authors call this the Cartesian N space. So R squared is the Euclidean plane. Here are some properties of the Cartesian product. First, we know that it's distributive over set union set intersection and set difference. Next, the Cartesian product behaves with respect to the inclusion relation as multiplication does with the total ordering relation and the real numbers. So if A is a subset of B, then the Cartesian product of A and C is a subset of the Cartesian product of B and C. Finally, for finite sets A and B, the cardinality of the Cartesian product of A with B is a product of the cardinality of the factors. This result is shown here algebraically.